There's no need to do that. Because if I take that stance, I'm now the next person who's the naysayer. I'm the next one who's invalidating them. And almost no therapist that I know would ever basically weaponize that or blame them for that kind of thing. What I can say is you may not have created it. And they, you, you probably didn't create it. Like leg pain's not being created. But if you sit there and focus on your left pinky toe, or if you talk about lice long enough, it's going to create head sensations of itch. That's how it works. When you focus on something long enough, you pay attention to it. And if you pay attention to it, you're more aware of it. And if you're more aware of it and your brain actually works, it'll feel it. Phantom limb syndrome research has demonstrated that. People putting a dummy arm and a fake arm in a mirror and whacking an arm, we can feel that in our nerve endings because our brain's processing information. So do we have a dead arm that's not connected to that's actually causing pain? No. Do we have a, a pain reception or an information processing thing going on? Probably. That's fascinating research. The point is, is I don't have to tell them that it's your fault or that you're creating it, but I can tell them that the thing you're doing is keeping it active. It's keeping it prominent in your, in your focus. And as long as you focus on that, you're not focusing on anything else. And if you're not focusing on anything else, we have a whole nother disease. Disease one, there's something wrong with your thigh. Maybe not medical. Disease two, you're fixated on it. You won't leave the house. You're demanding opiates. You're complaining to people. Your husband doesn't want to hear it anymore. Your doctors have cut you off. And I've worked with patients, I'm in Atlanta, that have been blacklisted from two of the three major hospital medical systems because they've done so much doctor shopping and so much fighting with their doctors that it's a stress on the system. But they have the wearables and the social media and the online and access to their patient portal that proves that something's wrong 